Want to understand how pre-stressed pipe piles are constructed? Here's the complete process explained clearly. First, the construction site is leveled to provide a stable working surface. Measurement and layout are then carried out according to the design drawings, and the exact pile positions are marked. The pile driver is moved into place, making sure the center of the hammer aligns precisely with the marked pile position. Next, the pipe pile is lifted vertically, turned upright, and slowly lowered, so the pile tip aligns with the ground marker. The pile is gently driven about 0.5 to 1 meter into the soil. Verticality correction follows using small hammer drops to ensure the pile remains stable and perfectly straight. Once alignment is confirmed, normal continuous hammering begins. If one pile section is not long enough, driving is stopped when the pile top is about 0.5 to 1 meter above ground. The next pile section is hoisted, aligned, and welded. After welding, the joint is allowed to cool naturally, inspected for quality, and coated with anti-corrosion asphalt paint. Pile driving then continues. If required, a pile follower is used to reach the designed elevation. As the pile enters the bearing stratum, penetration rate and elevation are checked, and hammering is stopped once requirements are met. Finally, excess pile head is cut, concrete core filling is completed, pile integrity is tested using the low strain method, and a static load test confirms bearing capacity.